Welcome to RenewEnergy.com, your renewable energy and sustainability platform. At RenewEnergy.com, we believe in the power of clean, sustainable energy to transform the way we live and work. That's why we offer a range of solutions for businesses and homeowners looking to switch to renewable energy sources such as solar, wind, and water. Welcome to today's deep dive into a critical subject in the evolving landscape of renewable energy technologies. Our focus will be on the Siemens Energy Sargent 800 gas turbine, a versatile and efficient machine already contributing to global power generation. While the Sargent 800 is known for its fuel flexibility and high efficiency, today we will explore an even more compelling dimension, its potential adaptability to hydrogen as a fuel source. Hydrogen is rapidly gaining attention as a clean, sustainable option, and its integration into systems like the Sargent 800 could signify a monumental shift toward greener energy solutions. Stay with us as we delve into this exciting frontier. What is the Siemens Sargent 800? The Siemens Sargent 800 is a robust industrial gas turbine designed for power generation and mechanical drive applications. With a power output range between 50 and 62 megawatts, this turbine is known for its versatility and operational efficiency. One of its standout features is its fuel flexibility. The Sargent 800 is capable of running on a wide range of fuels, from natural gas to various liquid fuels such as diesel and kerosene. The turbine employs a dual fuel capability, meaning it can switch between gas and liquid fuels even during operation, providing a high level of adaptability in different operational conditions. Designed for ease of maintenance and long service intervals, the Sargent 800 offers a reliable and cost-effective solution for energy production. In terms of environmental performance, it has a dry low emissions DLE, combustion system that significantly reduces nitrogen oxide emissions, making it a cleaner option compared to some other industrial turbines. The Sargent 800's attributes make it a leading choice for applications ranging from simple cycle, combined cycle, and cogeneration plants to industrial power generation and the oil and gas industry. Now, while it already offers a variety of fuel options, our focus today is on the potential for hydrogen to join that list, propelling the Sargent 800 into a new era of clean, renewable energy. The Rise of Hydrogen Hydrogen is increasingly gaining momentum as a cornerstone in the move toward a more sustainable and cleaner energy future. What sets hydrogen apart is its versatility as an energy carrier. It can be produced from a variety of sources, including natural gas, nuclear power, and renewable sources like solar and wind. Even more compelling is that when used as a fuel, its only byproduct is water, making it an extremely clean option. From a technological perspective, hydrogen can be utilized in a range of applications, from powering vehicles to providing grid storage solutions and even heating homes. Its ability to store and deliver energy efficiently makes it particularly attractive as a solution for intermittent renewable energy sources. One significant advantage of hydrogen is its potential to decarbonize sectors that are challenging to electrify, such as long-haul transportation and industrial processes, including steel and cement production. By integrating hydrogen into these sectors, it's possible to make substantial progress in reducing global greenhouse gas emissions. However, the potential of hydrogen extends beyond just these applications. As we will explore in this video, it also has the capacity to revolutionize the way we think about fuel for power generation turbines, such as the Siemens Energy Sargent 800. In summary, hydrogen is not merely an alternative fuel, it represents a multifaceted solution capable of addressing some of the most pressing energy and environmental challenges we face today. Hydrogen versus traditional fuels. When it comes to evaluating hydrogen against traditional fuels like natural gas or diesel, several key factors come into play. Let's delve into some of these to understand why hydrogen is gaining prominence as a potential fuel for turbines like the Siemens Sargent 800. Energy density. Traditional fuels such as natural gas and diesel have high energy densities, meaning they can store a lot of energy in a relatively small volume. Hydrogen, however, has a lower energy density by volume but a higher energy density by weight. This presents a challenge for storage and transportation but also provides an advantage in applications where weight is a critical factor. Emissions. One of the most compelling advantages of hydrogen is its environmental impact, or lack thereof. When burned, hydrogen produces only water vapor, eliminating the emissions of carbon dioxide and other pollutants. In contrast, burning traditional fossil fuels releases a variety of greenhouse gases and pollutants. Fuel flexibility. Many turbines like the Siemens Sargent 800 are already designed to be fuel flexible. However, the addition of hydrogen to the fuel mix would take this to a new level, allowing for a wider range of renewable fuel options and increasing the system's adaptability to different operational requirements. 
Combustion Characteristics Hydrogen has a wider flammability range and a higher flame speed than most fossil fuels. While this makes hydrogen highly reactive and efficient, it also presents challenges in modifying existing combustion systems to safely and effectively use hydrogen. Infrastructure and Cost Existing infrastructure is predominantly designed for traditional fuels, which presents a significant barrier for widespread hydrogen adoption. The cost of producing, storing, and distributing hydrogen also remains a challenge, although advancements in technology are gradually making it more economically viable. Safety Hydrogen's low ignition energy and high diffusivity mean that safety considerations, like containment and ventilation, differ substantially from those for fossil fuels. Proper safety measures would be a critical aspect of integrating hydrogen into any existing system. In summary, while hydrogen offers compelling benefits, especially in terms of emissions, its physical properties and current infrastructural limitations pose challenges that must be addressed for its successful integration into power generation systems like the Siemens Sargent 800. Hydrogen versus traditional fuels. Energy density. Conventional fuels like natural gas have a high energy density by volume, meaning they can store a significant amount of energy in a relatively small space. Hydrogen, on the other hand, has a lower energy density by volume but compensates with a higher energy density by weight. This characteristic poses challenges for storage but offers advantages in applications where weight is a critical factor. Environmental impact. Hydrogen stands out for its minimal environmental footprint. When used as a fuel, its only byproduct is water vapor, eliminating the emissions of CO2 and other greenhouse gases. Traditional fossil fuels, in contrast, release a range of pollutants, from carbon dioxide to sulfur compounds, when burned. Fuel flexibility. The Siemens Sargent 800 is already celebrated for its fuel flexibility. Introducing hydrogen into the mix could elevate this feature, allowing for an even broader range of renewable and low emission fuel options. This adaptability can be particularly valuable as energy markets continue to evolve. Combustion characteristics. Hydrogen's combustion properties differ markedly from those of traditional fuels. It has a wider flammability range and higher flame speed, making it highly reactive. While this means hydrogen can be more efficient in the combustion process, it also presents challenges for safely integrating it into existing systems. Economic and infrastructure concerns. Current infrastructure is optimized for fossil fuels, presenting an obstacle to widespread hydrogen adoption. Additionally, hydrogen production, storage, and distribution can be cost prohibitive, although advances in technology are increasingly mitigating these issues. Safety considerations. Hydrogen's unique properties, such as its low ignition energy and high diffusivity, mean that safety protocols for its use differ significantly from those for fossil fuels. Specialized containment and ventilation systems may be required to safely integrate hydrogen into existing operations. In summary, hydrogen offers compelling advantages, especially in terms of environmental benefits. However, its physical properties and the existing infrastructure designed for fossil fuels create challenges that must be carefully managed. These challenges are not insurmountable and, as we'll explore, companies like Siemens Energy are investing in research and development to unlock hydrogen's full potential in gas turbines like the Sargent 800. Technical Challenges Combustion Dynamics Hydrogen has unique combustion characteristics that differ significantly from traditional fuels. For one, it has a much wider flammability range and a faster flame speed. This poses challenges in controlling the combustion process. Adjustments may need to be made to the turbine's combustion chamber design and control systems to ensure efficient and safe operation. Material Considerations Hydrogen can be corrosive to certain materials, especially under high pressure and temperature conditions typical in a gas turbine environment. Material compatibility is thus a critical factor, requiring possible modifications to or replacements of existing components to withstand hydrogen's corrosive effects. Fuel mixing. Hydrogen's low density and high diffusivity mean that it behaves differently from conventional fuels when mixed with air for combustion. This could require redesigning the fuel injection system to ensure an optimal and safe air fuel mixture. Temperature and pressure constraints. Hydrogen combustion can generate higher temperatures compared to traditional fuels. This necessitates a careful look at the cooling systems in place, as well as potential modifications to withstand the increased thermal load. Control systems. Given hydrogen's unique combustion properties, existing control systems may not be equipped to manage hydrogen combustion effectively. Upgraded or specialized control systems could be needed for real-time monitoring and adjustments. Emission control. Although hydrogen combustion primarily produces water, 
The high combustion temperatures can lead to the formation of nitrogen oxides, NOx. Specialized emission control technologies may be necessary to keep these emissions within regulatory limits. System integration. Beyond the turbine itself, integrating hydrogen would also involve changes to fuel storage, transportation, and handling systems. This adds another layer of complexity, as these systems must be designed or adapted to safely store and deliver hydrogen to the turbine. In summary, the adaptation of the Siemens Sargent 800 to utilize hydrogen involves a series of technical challenges, each requiring specialized solutions. While these challenges are substantial, they are not insurmountable. The ongoing research and development efforts in this area are a testament to the industry's commitment to unlocking hydrogen's potential in power generation. Commitment to Sustainability Siemens Energy has been vocal about its commitment to a more sustainable energy landscape. A key aspect of this is their investment in research and development aimed at hydrogen fuel integration. The company understands that hydrogen can play a crucial role in decarbonizing various sectors, including power generation, which brings us to their work with gas turbines like the Sargent 800. Hydrogen-ready turbines. Siemens Energy is actively researching hydrogen-ready turbines, designed to adapt to varying ratios of hydrogen and natural gas. This allows for a gradual transition as hydrogen production scales up, ensuring a smoother path towards full hydrogen fuel capability. Partnerships and collaboration. Siemens Energy has engaged in multiple partnerships with academic institutions, governments, and industry experts to push the boundaries of hydrogen technology. These collaborations aim to solve some of the technical challenges associated with hydrogen use, including combustion dynamics, material science, and system integration. Pilot projects. The company has been involved in several pilot projects testing hydrogen as a fuel source. These projects serve as real-world laboratories, providing valuable data that inform the ongoing development and eventual commercial deployment of hydrogen-fueled power systems. Technological innovations. Siemens Energy is also focusing on technological advancements to make hydrogen a more viable option. This includes the development of new materials resistant to hydrogen embrittlement and corrosion, advanced combustion control systems, and efficient methods for hydrogen production and storage. Policy and Regulation Engagement Understanding that policy plays a significant role in the adoption of new technologies, Siemens Energy actively engages with regulatory bodies. The company works to shape policies that encourage hydrogen use and create a favorable environment for investment and research in this area. In summary, Siemens Energy is at the forefront of integrating hydrogen into the modern energy landscape. Through targeted R&D, strategic partnerships, and a commitment to innovation, they are laying the groundwork for a more sustainable future, where hydrogen can be harnessed to its full potential. Future Outlook The horizon looks promising for hydrogen-powered turbines. As countries set ambitious carbon-neutral targets, the demand for renewable and low-emission energy sources like hydrogen is likely to soar. Various governments are introducing policies and financial incentives to accelerate hydrogen production and integration. For instance, the European Union has already committed to significant hydrogen infrastructure development as part of its Green Deal. On the technological front, ongoing research is targeting the efficient production, storage, and transportation of hydrogen. The lessons learned from pilot projects and academic research are being used to enhance system designs and tackle existing challenges. In the industry, Siemens Energy and other major players are expected to unveil more hydrogen-ready turbines, and possibly even full hydrogen-fueled solutions, in the coming years. These advancements are not just incremental, they have the potential to revolutionize the energy sector. Conclusion The integration of hydrogen as a fuel source for turbines like Siemens Energy's Sargent 800 is more than a technical feat, it is a pivotal move towards a cleaner and more sustainable energy landscape. The properties of hydrogen, though challenging to harness, offer remarkable benefits, primarily in terms of reducing harmful emissions. With giants like Siemens Energy leading the way in research and development, the future appears increasingly green. If you found this deep dive into hydrogen-powered turbines enlightening, please hit the like button below. Have thoughts or questions? Feel free to share them in the comments section. For more in-depth content on renewable energy technologies and the future of sustainable energy, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Your engagement fuels our motivation to keep bringing you the latest insights in renewable energy. Thank you for choosing RenewEnergy.com as your go-to source for all things renewable energy and sustainability. With our YouTube channel, we explore the latest developments and innovations in the field, including hydrogen fuel cells and the use of AI and machine learning to optimize energy consumption. If you're ready to take the next step towards a cleaner, more sustainable future, 
Visit us at renewenergy.com and discover the many ways we can help you transition to renewable energy. Thank you for watching and subscribing. Stay up to date on all the latest news and insights by subscribing today.